If you are planning on buying a home in the Olympia area in 2022, you may be wondering if it's still a good time to buy and where's the market heading? Here are my predictions based on the local market and national experts, plus tips to help you make the most of the 2022 real estate market. Hi, I'm Francine Viola, Realtor in Olympia, Washington, and it is the end of December. I'm currently socked in with about a foot of snow at my house, which is unusual for our area, but 2021 has been an unusual year, so this is totally fitting to end the year with a foot of snow. Probably the biggest question I get from potential buyers is if 2022 is still a good year to buy a house. Buyers are worried about rising home prices, low inventory, interest rates going up, and how all of this will affect the real estate market. Here is my forecast for 2022 buyers. In 2021, home price gains broke records, finishing the year with 20% annual gains on average in the Olympia area. Considering the historic gains averaged about 5-6% to annually, this huge gain between 2020 and 2021 for home prices was impressive. It's also unsustainable in my opinion. I think home prices in 2022 will still go up, but not at this crazy pace. I'm forecasting home prices will be up 8 to 10%. What affected Olympia's sharp increase in home prices in 2021 were low supply of homes for sale, coupled with high buyer demand for housing, low interest rates, low unemployment, COVID creating more virtual jobs where people could live anywhere, and Olympia's relative affordability. The low inventory is one of the biggest drivers of increasing home prices. Fewer listings, but high buyer demand equals higher sales prices. When the market has more listings, buyer competition eases and home prices stabilize. As we get out of COVID, I think more and more sellers will come to the market, but we still will be very much in a seller's market. 2022 will not be a balanced nor a buyer's market, and I think we will be deep into a seller's market for years. So buyers will still be in a competitive market. Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac predict interest rates will go up from about 3% currently to 3.3 to 3.5% in 2022. Combined with rising prices, this uptick in interest rates could be enough to price some buyers out of the market, although I still do not see this as a huge influence that would significantly slow down the market. Timing the market is very difficult, if not impossible, because there are so many factors that can influence the market. But real estate is typically the long game. In 2011, the median sales price in Thurston County was just under $225,000. Now, 10 years later, the median home price is 107% higher at $465,000. Don't you wish you bought a home 10 years ago? You might be saying that 10 years from now in 2032. Although buyers are feeling the price shock of today's home prices, I still think this is a great time to buy as home prices will be higher 10 years from now than they are today. The good news is mortgage rates are still historically low and new listings are coming to the market daily. I believe competition amongst buyers will decrease slightly, but buyers still need to be prepared to submit their best offer. Here are some tips for succeeding in the 2022 real estate market. Use a brokerage site to search for homes for sale. Third-party sites like Zillow, Trulia, and Realtor.com don't always list everything that is available for sale and will list off-market homes as for sale and vice versa. Use my website or a brokerage site to make sure you are seeing all the listings that are available. Know the area where you are buying. I've worked with so many out-of-state buyers this year who wanted to buy a home in the Olympia area, but they had never been here before. Plan a trip to tour the area or plan on finding temporary housing while you determine which part of town suits you best. Have your financing in order? Whether you plan to pay cash for your next home or get financing, have your funds ready. For borrowers, being approved by a local or reputable lender will help you win the bidding war. Talk to me for local lender referrals that will put you ahead of other buyers. Shorten contingency timelines or remove contingencies altogether. If the boilerplate language for a particular contingency is 10 days, maybe consider shortening that to five days. Waive non-essential contingencies and submit a streamlined offer. Non-essential contingencies vary with each buyer, 
we'll discuss your best route, but the takeaway here is to submit a clean offer with only your most essential contingencies. Get your offer in before the review date. Here in Thurston County, sellers will indicate the date they will review offers, but sellers have the right to accept an offer prior to that review date. Submit your offer as soon as you can. Submit your highest and best offer. Don't rely on the seller countering your offer. With most sellers receiving multiple offers, they will simply select the best offer without countering. Submit your best offer because you may not have another opportunity. Know the seller's wants and needs. Some sellers will have preferred terms and if you can accommodate those, you'll be ahead of other buyers. This is where I will talk with the listing agent to find out the seller's wants and needs so we can craft a winning offer. The good news I predict for 2022 buyers is I think the crazy buyer frenzy of the spring 2021 market will stay in the past. Buyers then were waiving home inspections altogether just to get their offer accepted. I don't think buyers will need to be this aggressive in 2022 because I'm predicting the competition will ease up just enough this coming year to avoid that. Be sure to check out the full blog post with more predictions, but if 2022 is the year for you to make a move, contact me today. Happy New Year!